Right then guys, welcome back to a brand new video. I am back on the promenade today, but I'm not going to be having a walk up and down the promenade. I am joined by the Blackpool lads, and we have been invited to do a bubble tea. So we don't go there, see what it's all about, try to ask some questions what you guys might be thinking, and see is it for, for me, and say is it for yourselves? So this bubble tea is based I go right across the road, road from Central Pier and right next door from the famous Happy Days. So yeah, everything is all freshly made to order and none of this way is just kept into one place or anything. So you come you order your flavour and then it all freshly made and this is Leah she has been here for three years doing bubble tea in Blackpool have you ever tried bubble tea before? if so let me know what flavour you use what flavour your favourite so she's just adding some ice now not the white wine, it's seven and three. I did try one of these the other day and the new pop in your mouth. Right on the number three. So do the do this type of business run into your family? Like did your mum used to do it or just you? I, I like the drink of a body. <laughs> um, it's been so popular in China. Yeah. 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 So there you go. It's very popular in China. And everything is all fresh also when they make it. So, of course, I just went with the green apple. And it is quite warm today. I just like the lids, I do. Stop right there, we're rolling back the price. Oh, nice and refreshing. Wow, now. This is nice and refreshing, actually. You can tell with the ice, it cool it down also. So, yeah. Really nice. Oh, the Blackpool lad, what is your thought? Well, you got the pineapple, did you? I tell you, that's gorgeous. You see the, uh, the apples in there? Uh, one, two, you three, have the come up. Six, you see the feet there? They've got laws to choose from. You got your black tea, green tea, something like the sender milk, special tea, fruit bubble tea, and a latte. So, yeah, there is so much to choose from. I'll move back a bit so you know what about it is. Just right there. The chimney store looks in Blackpool. They all say breakfast and they've got a whole menu available to Now it's just sorting out the chips, what you can see on the front. Look like they're putting some kind of seasoning on there. Just out the back. Oh wow, look at that. Here, look at this. This is the barbecue flavour and it is very Moorish, I got to say. This is used by a warm full potato, fresh every day. That, that is well nice. 
walking through Blackpool when it's a bit cold, this will soon warm you up. Mm, yeah. Right, so I'm moving away from the happy days bit now. Just so you can hear me a bit better. But yeah, she called Leah, the girl what runs that place. And she's been doing it for three years in Blackpool. And it meant to be quite popular over in China, she was saying. Oh yeah, we're going to offer lots of different things, so a bit of food, a bit of drinks. And she's in an okay location, I would say a prime location, shall I say. Because um, there's lots of traffic where she is going past. So hopefully she do well for over a year here in Blackpool. So I think that's going to be the end of this video over here. And they do open about 12.30. And the closing time all depends on like what happening, probably the weather, how busy and stuff like that. But if you did enjoy this video, then please give it a big thumbs up. If you want to see more videos of Blackpool itself, then please hit that subscribe button. And if you don't want to miss any upcoming videos, then please turn on that notification bell. And I'll see you on the next one.